for today's video, we learn how to grow lots of tomatoes. Isang nanay, tatay, isang gulay project. Let's go! Let's learn how to plant tomatoes. Take some fresh tomatoes, cut them into slices. Or use fresh seeds from the market. These are the seeds. Take a small pot with drainage holes at the bottom. Fill it with the potting mix. You can use seed starting mix for the just 60% normal garden soil plus 40% vermicompost. Place the slices on the surface of the potting mix. You can also remove the tomato flesh to avoid any fungus growth. Lightly cover with soil and pat down lightly. Water well. Keep the pot in partial shade and with the seed starts to germinate, move the pot into full sun or undergrowth lights. Seeds can be sown from September to October. Keep the soil evenly moist during the germination phase. When the seedlings are 6 to 8 inches tall at that point, you can transplant them at the final location. For the potting mix use, well trained soil with good amount of organic matter as tomato plants require fertile soil for good harvest. percent garden soil mix well before use and 40 percent organic compost choose a container that is at least 18 to 20 inches in diameter and it 15 to 18 inch deep fill the bag with the potting mix Make sure to make holes in the pot or the poly bag for drainage. With the help of gardening tool, take the plants out from the seedling pot. Make sure not to disturb the roots during the transplanting process. Keep the root ball intact to avoid any transplant shock.
be very careful when lifting the plant out of its original container or you could damage the roots. Dig a hole about 6 to 8 inches deep. Make sure that you remove all the leaves and branches below the soil line. Tomatoes must be planted deeply. Deep planting encourages healthy and strong root system. At the time of planting, cover bottom two-third part of the plant with potting. They actually have the ability to sprout additional roots along the buried stem. These extra roots strengthen the plant so that it can be good and productive. Fill in the hole or trench with the sum of the soil you remove. Only the top few inches of the plant will be exposed. In containers, keep at least 6 to 8 inch gap between two plants and in ground cap must be of 1.5 to 2 feet. Cover with soil and pat down lightly. Water the seedlings immediately after transplanting for letting them settle well. Throughout the growing season, continue to water thoroughly whenever the top layer of the soil dry. After transplanting, keep the bag or the pot in the partial for two days. Let the plants recover the plants or from the plant shop and after that, transpose the plants to the sand. Your tomato plants need between 4 to 6 hours of total sun per day in order to grow and eventually produce fruit. Water at least once a day to soil to keep the top layer of the soil evenly moist. Simultaneously, good drainage on the pot is, is also very important. You can fertilize the plants with fish milk, chicken, manure, vermicompost, or any other organic fertilizer. Mix well in the soil, then water the plants thoroughly. You will need to repeat the fertilizing processes after 18 to 20 days. The key to tomato success is to give your tomato plants a consistent amount of water. The goal is to keep the soil moist and more growth the plant. Too much water and your plants roots will rot. Too little water and your plants will get weak. Make sure to water the soil, not the plants as wet leaves as it carries diseases and fungus. Spray the plants after every 6-8 days with homemade organic pesticides made from neem oil garlic. And here are the formula. Wait for the tomato to turn the correct color. Check the plants daily once they begin to ripen to ensure peak flavor. Gently twist the fruits and avoid pulling at the vine. Harvest your tomatoes one by one once they develop their red color. This can be plucked by gently pulling at the stem of your fingers or use sharp scissor to snip them of their branches. A fully ripe tomato will be softer. A fully ripe tomato will be softer than the unripe ones. Before you eat tomatoes that you harvest, wash them thoroughly with water. This will help you to remove any fertilizer, risk, dirt, or bacteria. Thank you so much!